So yesterday we got a new trailer for a game coming called Project Magnum. It's a new third person looter shooter created by Nexon and while people are already doing the usual and calling it the next Destiny killer. This is some kind of weird trend now because of the footprint Destiny has left on this genre. It's a goal too for any looter shooter in regards to a comparison. Today guys we get into the few details we know so far about this new game Project Magnum. How's it going guys my name is DPJ and if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe. So if you didn't see the trailer itself check it out right here. <laughs> So Project Magnum is coming to PlayStation consoles and PC. It at the moment hasn't got any release date and is still classed as a working title. Now after researching tons the details I could find were minimal but I guess that's because the reveal is literally brand new. Now it's believed though the entire game is a PvE game where you can play up to a team of four with your friends. It is a looter shooter or a part of this genre but like many other looter shooters there are those ability based aspects to it too. We can see by the trailer that abilities are here, where the actual gunplay gameplay isn't made too much of a drama about. It is like I said third person which makes sense judging by the aspects of the trailer we have seen and it looks like it will play better in third person too. Now I won't lie from what I have seen I am seeing a mix of Outriders Destiny and a few other games drawn in here. The abilities from what we do see look cool and I love the look of that grapple hook. But besides this we see many other abilities on show. We see some form of trooper charging with a hammer. We see what looks to be like different elements of abilities too. And I think I'm right in saying a few different classes to represent these abilities. The trailer hits the right spots for sure. And if you're a looter shooter fan like me, I'm pretty sure you will agree. But, and this is a massive but, how many of these amazing trailers for these new looter shooters have we seen? Too many to remember. Success rate of them is about 5%. <laughs> this might be different guys, but right now it's way too early to tell. Now as more details drop on this game, I will have you covered right here on my channel for sure, as I am all over looter shooters as you guys know. Now a little bit of information I found from about a month back, which is info unveiled uh, by this game's dev Nexon. So this is a statement from about a month back. Nexon unveiled information on new games in development in its studio in Seoul, South Korea today, including the recently announced Project Magnum. Project HP and Mobinogi Mobile, plus 9 additional games. The company also announced the sub-brand Project Early Stage, which it describes as games developed at a faster pace and brought to market where they can be fine-tuned based on valuable input from players. Now you can take this how you please, in my opinion the Project Early Stage is what most devs are doing nowadays and have done over the past few years. 
They release games way too early and games seemingly still ain't fixed months and months later. I think here next and I'll just cover no on asses. Does this mean the game will be rushed out and land of a pile of ass like Outriders and Anthem? It doesn't necessarily mean that, but the possibility is there. I mean, if they're rushing a game like this out, there's going to be a big chance there will be many problems. But what do you guys think? The next Destiny Killer? In my opinion, never. And on that note, the end of the video has arrived. If you enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully I will see you on that next one.